Today at Northview Porter House, we're looking around our incredible BMW M4 competition, finished in metallic Toronto red with 19 inch front and 20 inch rear alloy wheels finished in black. Only one owner from new on this example with full BMW history and a really high spec as well. We'll explore more of that once we get inside the vehicle. So you've got these beautiful gloss black trims matching the wheels throughout and the spoiler lip as well. Really nice clean example. Does also benefit from PPF over the front end, the front bumper, headlights, wings and bonnet. And we can see just what a good job has been done. You'll see the small relief cuts just in the corner there and around the badging as well. A really good job. Also got them on the headlights. You can see the relief cut up there. It does also have the visibility pack so you can see the blue inside the headlights there. Really nice feature for the new M cars. And it's also got the 360 camera as well. You can see that in between the center of the front grille. So we'll just have a quick look inside now. So just starting off with the passenger side, we can see the power fold mirrors. Also has the comfort access. Door cards all in excellent condition. And we've also got the armor card and sound system just up there and the triangle in the corner of the mirror is the blind spot assist you can see full electric seats still in excellent condition as you would expect as is the rear and just looking in the boot space now we've got the electric tailgate and we can see Lots of space in here, and you can just pull the levers to release the rear seats as well. And we've got the first head kit just down there. Now we're finally finishing off on the driver's side. Again, door card, all in excellent condition. We've got the memory function for the driver's seat just there. The powerful mirrors and window controls there. And we can see the boot release just down there as well. Driver's seat again, excellent condition. really well looked after uh, into the rear again all in excellent condition so we'll jump in and get it started now so we're just in the driver's seat and we can see the mileage just over 15,000 push button to start got full carbon on the interior and on the steering wheel as well which is also heated got the button just here and the carbon continues across the dash there as well also have the original book pack of course in there and I do believe we have the original bill of sale from when the owner purchased the vehicle. Also got the carbon fiber, carbon fiber flappy paddles as well, excuse me, and we'll go over some of the features uh, on the home screen now. So firstly we can see the sat nav just up on the white screen there. We'll just bring the home up, it's got Android and Apple CarPlay, it does also have the wireless phone charging just down there behind the cup holders and we've got the head up display you can see visually just there with the speed limit display as well we've also got the steering assist which is just here for the lane keep and then we've got the adaptive cruise with the radar either side for setting the distance and you've also got the automatic high beam you can see coming on just on the left hand side there So we just go down to car, vehicle status, go across to service, service history, got the PDI originally, the running in check and the most recent service in April 24, brake fluid not until 25, emission inspection, engine oil in 26 on, in 17,000 miles and then also vehicle check, so a couple of years before any major services at all. So we'll just put it into reverse now. We'll see we've got the surround view on the right hand side and the rear view cam on the left hand side. You can switch those how you'd like and you've also got park assist just up there in the top right hand corner. And then we've also got multiple driving modes. 
So we can just click through some of those. So you've got this four, and you can see the dials change and the dash there. And just for clarity, there's nothing actually flashing on there. It's just the camera picking up some sort of film signal. And then we can go across to the track mode as well. And you can see that's just loaded up on there and the exhaust has been activated. So guys, I think that's most of the features explored inside. So we'll let the vehicle warm up and then we'll see what it sounds like. So guys, we've let the vehicle warm up and we're in comfort mode. Let's see what it sounds like. And then we'll go across to track mode now and just let him load that up. So guys, that's the end of the video. I hope that's been informative. Any questions or queries, please do get in touch with the sales team. Our contact details should be on the screen now. Thank you.